The video you're about to see is the final walkthrough of a 22 container, 2500 square meter plus high school built in Mwanza, Tanzania. The school is designed to work with young people that have no formal identification and in conjunction with the Living Waters Orphanage that has been doing ministry in the area for 20 years. One of the local staff took the time to walk through the school with me as we come close to the end of the completion of this project. The design for the building was placed on the side of a hill that would not be suitable for any other construction, especially in the developing world. But by using shipping containers, we could cantilever the building off the side of the hill and create spaces not only inside the containers and between the containers, but also underneath the containers. The standard classroom of the school is 60 square meters, 10 meters by 6 meters, compiled of two and a half shipping containers and spaces of 2.4 meters between each box that are then used with a reinforcing steel for the floors and for the ceilings. No material on the site is wasted as the floor inserts and the ceiling inserts are the cutouts from the side walls and are saved and cut accordingly. The classrooms are designed to host up to 60 students, but work comfortably between 35 to 45 units in each room. Ventilation is provided by some large aluminium windows that slide open, and the container doors are also put in such a way that they can increase the volume of airflow into each room. The container doors are used in such a way as to provide security for the building at a low cost, without having to remanufacture security doors for the school. As mentioned, the first floor of the school and the basement are designed for disabled access, while the third floor is only accessible by stairs. The finish on this particular school is rather high-end, supporting ceramic tile floors, poured hallways, and aluminium windows. However, if budget are an issue, the container doors can be utilized just in their standard format to provide a very, very secure and safe space at little to no cost. The Living Water School is a 42 meter long building and 16 meters wide and supports a beautiful view of Lake Victoria from all of its outside balcony positions. Though not yet completed, this 120 square meter classroom is designed to be the science lab for the school on the third floor separated from the rest of the building. The school itself is completely off-grid, supporting a 5 kVA photovoltaic system and a water collection system to use for the bathrooms. All stairwells in this building are created between the negative space between two containers so that it's easy to fit the building with steel and structures that are bespoke for that particular building. This particular school supports over 720 meters of external decking versus an internal hallway system, allowing the building to be cooler and more cost effective. This is by no means meant to be a Western style school. It is meant to be a clean, practical and efficient space to be used to make up the difference between third world developing countries and first world education systems. We hope that if this video twigged something in you, you'd contact us at Hebner Innovative Solutions or send us an email, it'll be listed on the video below. Thank you and we hope this has inspired you and encouraged you to do what you can inside your community to make a difference.